Hey guys, welcome back to the MCUHQ. It is November 30th, 2021, also known as the release of Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings on DVD, Blu-ray, and 4K. So, I went and picked it up, and I recorded a vlog of me picking it up, and then realized that it's only about like 55 seconds of footage. I'm not gonna upload that. So, I'm just doing an unboxing for you guys, and hopefully when Eternals releases on Blu-ray, that'll be a much more exciting uh, buying video. So I did end up going with the 4K. I'm not a fan of the poster for this movie, and I, I like the look of the 4K better. Um, still not ideal. The Mandarin should have been on the back, but he's not. So, whatever. Settled for the best I could get, and this was the best I could get. So, I'm going to unbox it for you guys. First off, there you go, 4K, Blu-ray, and a digital code. I'm going to show you guys the digital code and then redeem it before I upload the video. That way, y'all can get uh, be hopeful and then not get the code. So, let's. Uh, we do have, for the art there, it's Shang-Chi with the rings, uh, which is honestly kind of cool. His suit's really popping in that cover art. Suit is really popping. So let us, oh yeah, there's the back of the slip cover, by the way. Let's pop that off, and then there we go. It's the same thing there, and same thing on the back. So let's, let's get the trusty car key out, and let's slice that plastic. I love new, I, I, I love getting new movies. They always smell like, uh, smells like retail and capitalism. All right, the plastic is off. There we go. Before I crack it open, I'm gonna read what comes with this. Uh, it, it gives you your little uh, briefing on what 4K is. I'm not gonna read that. And then uh, some bonus extras here that you get. Deleted scenes, gag reel, family ties, which is dive into the rich but complicated legacy of Shang-Chi and Zhu Wenwu. Definitely gonna check that out. Building a legacy, go behind the scenes and explore Shang-Chi's explosive debut in the MCU and audio commentary. Now, the one thing that's not on this Blu-ray or the Blu-ray for Black Widow, which I understand because they're on Disney+, Plus, but it would be cool if they had the assembled episode packed with this Blu-ray because those are some really cool documentaries. But it's on Disney+, Plus, and let's be real, most of us have Disney+, Plus at this point because we're watching the Marvel shows, so... Uh, yeah, and because it's a Blu-ray, it's a Cinematic Universe Edition at the bottom. There's there's that cover one more time. Uh, and cracking this guy open, we got the digital code right there for you. Just take a, take a nice little look at that, if it'll focus. Okay, I think that's in focus, I can't tell. But there you go. There's the code for the movie you guys aren't going to get. And then a uh, little advertisement for Disney Movie Club. Join the club and get four movies for a dollar. And they tell you you can get Mulan, the live action one. They're out of damn mind. Ryan the Last Dragon, haven't seen it. Soul, have seen it. Pretty solid movie. And The Lion King, best movie ever made. So there they go. They redeemed themselves for advertising the live action Mulan. And now on the back, they do the same thing with Marvel. And they told you you get Captain Marvel. Disney, come on! How do you put the worst movie on it on both sides? And then Avengers Endgame, a significantly better movie, and Guardians of the Galaxy, even better than that. So there they go. I guess they redeemed themselves for that too. And we do have a cover art for the 4K. So the normal Blu-ray is just the Blu-ray blue, and then the 4K is Shang-Chi there on the disc. And I think, I want to say, it's just the movie on the 4K. And the Blu-ray is where the bonus features are. So there you go. And then, uh, uh, this is the slip cover independent of the case, if any of you wanted to see that. And there we go. There is Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. I'm gonna go put it on the shelf. Fine, I just did that, and uh, it reminded me that I need to print the custom covers for Falcon and the Winter Soldier, Loki, and What If, because I want those on there and they're not. So what version of Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings did you buy? And also, just let me know your thoughts on the movie. It's a good movie, now it's out on Blu-ray, and I know Spider-Man comes out in just over two weeks, but let's talk a bit more about Shang-Chi because it was a really good movie. 
Let me know all that down in the comments below. Also, leave a like on this video, subscribe, click on the bell icon to receive all notifications from the MSOHQ. That's going to be it. Have a great day, guys.